Hi, I'm Noah Bombard, and here's what's happening in the ET Newsroom Wednesday, November 24. Well, of course, the big news yesterday was the announcement by Essex County DA Jonathan Blodgett that no charges were going to be pressed against police after the death of uh, Kenneth Howe uh, just about a year ago uh, in police custody. Now, he was apprehended at a routine uh, uh, sobriety checkpoint right outside the Eagle Tribune offices here. Our own uh, photographer, Carl Russo, provided uh, many of the photos that were used in the investigation. But the story doesn't stop there. Today at 3 p.m., an attorney for the family of Kenneth Howe is having his own press conference in Boston. We're going to be on hand for that. Uh, J.J. Huggins will be there reporting. I'll be there uh, uploading some video of the press conference uh, shortly afterwards. Now, what they're going to announce, we have no idea. However, the family has been pursuing a civil case against state police and against the DA's office, uh, saying that essentially uh, their actions uh, resulted in the death of Kenneth Howe and they're seeking damages. So although the, uh, the criminal case, or the criminal case that never existed, I should say, uh, has gone away, uh, that civil case still exists whether or not they'll announce at 3 p.m. that they're going through with that or they've reached some deal, we don't know. We suspect uh, they'll probably uh, just be reacting to the DA's uh, findings uh, that they just received uh, yesterday along with the rest of us. So that press conference is at 3 p.m. You can look for that video around uh, 4 p.m. or so as soon as I can get it up online. Well, the other big news this week is we have a story coming up later on this week by our own Bill Kirk on uh, Lawton's Hot Dogs, which it appears as of December 31st will be closing for good. Now, we did stories uh, last year on Lawton's uh, when they had to shut down for several months uh, due to uh, some uh, issues with the embankment uh, where their building is located. Uh, the owners say that uh, work on the bridge nearby and proposed work on the canal has just made uh, uh, business very difficult. They're very spotty. Uh, they've tried to move, uh, but with their lease being up and with no place to go, they say as of December 31st, this long-standing uh, Lawrence tradition may shut its doors for good. So Bill Kirk is working on that story. You can expect that later on this week. I'm actually going to take two minutes on the road again on Friday. We'll be uh, broadcasting uh, from uh, Lawton's Hot Dogs. Just reminding you, find all this content and a lot more at eagletspoon.com right now.